A FOX 2 FOLLOW-UP TONIGHT ON THIS SINKHOLE IN BELLEVILLE. AN ELDERLY COUPLE CALLS THE YOU PAID FOR IT TEAM BECAUSE OF DANGEROUS SINKHOLES IN THEIR BACKYARD GETTING DEEPER ALL THE TIME. THE 86-YEAR-OLD FRUSTRATED HOMEOWNER CALLS Elliot DAVIS FOR HELP IN TONIGHT'S YOU PAID FOR IT. BELLEVILLE HOMEOWNER ROBERT PAYNE NEVER DREAMED HE'D BE DEALING WITH A PROBLEM LIKE THIS AT 86 YEARS OLD. THE SINKHOLES IN HIS BACKYARD HAS BEEN A MAJOR HEADACHE FOR HIM AND HIS WIFE MALLY, WHO'S 75 YEARS YOUNG. THE SINKHOLES IN THEIR BACKYARD ARE CAUSED BY BELLEVILLE'S STORM SEWER PIPES RUNNING UNDER THE YARD THAT HAVE GONE BAD. IT'S PRODUCED THIS SINKHOLE THAT'S ABOUT THREE FEET DEEP, AND THERE'S AN EVEN LARGER ONE RIGHT NEXT TO THIS ONE WITH A TARP ON TOP TO PREVENT SOMEONE FROM FALLING IN. How long have you guys been dealing with this? Almost two years. Almost two years. How long have you been calling the city? Two years. And still not fixed? No. I want it fixed. That's my thoughts. Because mm -hmm. I'm tired of looking out here. What are your thoughts about this? It's absolutely disgusting. We are just at our wits end. And that's when me and my daughter got together and decided to take it to the media because they just give us the run around, they're dragging their feet. The city acknowledges it's Belleville's fault. Various city agencies have been involved with problems in the Payne family's yard brought on by storm sewer issues. The Board of Aldermen has even appropriated $169,000 to fix the problem. The mayor told me the city bureaucracy just dragging out the process. My view is that I think government procedures are <laughs> take a, too long in general. It's going to get done. Oh, yes, it's going to get done if I have to go out there and do it myself. And I do know how to dig plenty of holes because I love gardening. But no, I will, I will make sure. What would you tell the city? I need you to fix my yard. Mm -hmm. And I need you to do it now. Not yesterday or today. Now. Sure. The mayor says the city should be done sometime in December. And I hope they do accept my apology for taking so long. So while City Hall promises to fix this problem, this couple, of course, have been waiting a long time. They'll be glad when this eyesore is gone. Of course, I'll stay on top of this deal. After all, you paid for it.